friends, I hope you all are doing great. It's me, Nikki here, and I'm in my office. You all know that I started my professional organizing business and I've been enjoying and so busy, but I wanted to take uh, this moment to take you on this journey of putting this little closet together. My office, we don't have much space here, so I'm trying to make the best of all of this space. And so this is basically the only closet we have. Um, so it's very important to us. And as you can see, it has an eyesore. It has our little water heater. Yes, this is how small my office is. It can handle that water heater. And so what I did was the bottom half I had painted white and the top half you can see is still the color of the old office before we painted, uh, the office before we painted. And so there was no need to paint there and I'll tell you why. So I was trying to find how can I make the most use of that space because that's a lot of valuable real estate and the water heater is just taking it up. So pegboard was the answer that I came up with. Now you can see here there's a shelf and then there's a little ledge there. And so I could sit the pegboard up on the ledge and it fit perfectly I, you go to Home Depot or Lowe's and they'll cut it for you and then I got some industrial strength velcro to put um, on the top of the pe pegboard where you can't see it to push it against the front of the closet so that it was really a tight strong fit and worked great so now what I have done is totally covered that eyesore, have it ventilated still, not that it needs ventilation, but just, you know, just still. But I have plenty of storage and you all know how I love the pegboard storage because you can put things like your scissors or you can put your tape and all kinds of things that you need. And the great thing about it being here, it's kind of in the lobby area, the main area when we do a lot of filming and working in different things, a lot of traffic for us. And so we can easily get to those key things that we use all the time. Now, as far as the bottom, I went with something that I could do easily and I purchased these these little rods here to put the shelves in this is so simple you can get from home or Home Depot or Lowe's and you basically you screw in the two brackets against the wall and it allows you to put in shelves in different locations so I can adjust these shelves when I need very cost-effective shelving unit and works perfectly there you'll notice that although I painted below I have a few marks on my wall because I took the shelves out to show you actually how they were installed and again you get the, sh the shelves from Lowe's or Home Depot you know any store and and when I was in, uh, I think it was Lowe's, I found these organizational bins. I thought that they were, were nice, but you can get them from Target or Walmart or anywhere, but they fit perfectly on the bottom shelf and gave me plenty of storage. So as you can see, I have organized the pegboard. I have my organization systems in place and plenty of room for all of those supplies to be our perfect supply closet. And I love it. So to take you on a little tour of the little supply closet here, we have the pegboard on top and in the square bins at the bottom, I keep our tool kit, mailing supplies, and I have one that's still empty, which I'm sure we'll put to use. Um, for me and the organizing assistants, I have label makers there. And then I have things that we use when we go out for sessions. And so it keeps all those sp supplies easy to get to. Then I have office supplies here, such as tape and staples and just those general, general things. In this big box below is just our envelopes and mailing items. And then we also have the keep our broom in here because like I said this is a very small space and so the thing with the broom is it I got it from Ikea and I may invest in another one because I was planning on hanging it on the door but it has no holes in it so for now I just slide it into the side of the closet and it fits perfectly because it's kind of short and so on the pegboard I keep those things that we typically grab for like if we need a flashlight or we rulers a little hammer measuring tape I have scissors there and so just those things that are important I have a little calendar there and a little pad to write down any supplies that we need and we can just jot it down there as we see. So this is my office supply cabinet in my new business. I hope you all enjoyed seeing this and the creative ways that I'm trying to come up with organizational solutions for this small space. I hope you all are doing great. I will see you at the next video. And this is Nikki saying goodbye.